I don't know. Is anyone gonna buy it? I mean, do I look pregnant? I mean, I guess I can see it. Welcome to Watch Mojo's Secondhand Cringe. And today, we're counting down our picks for the funniest ways TV shows hid pregnancies. Number 10, Courtney Cox, Friends. Who among us didn't share in Monica and Chandler's heartbreak when they learned that they wouldn't be able to conceive a baby? Instead, we followed them on their adoption journey, where they would eventually become parents to twins in a surprise twist. However, not long after this story arc began, actress Courtney Cox announced her own pregnancy, and the showrunners had no other choice but to try to creatively, though not always successfully, use baggy clothes and huge props to cover her up. However, as the weeks progressed, it became harder and harder not to notice. And remember, if I am harsh with you, it is only because you're doing it wrong. Number 9. Leah Remini, The King of Queens Instead of making Carrie Heffernan pregnant, this sitcom embraced Leah's weight gain in a very convenient way. In a recurring storyline, Carrie finds herself looking for work, but also lounging around in sweats or a bathrobe, perfect outfits for concealing a baby bump. She can also be seen clutching a pillow on her stomach or relaxing in bed. Carrie finds work just as Leah's pregnancy becomes more noticeable, giving her more ways to hide her bump. I worked so hard this week and then I finished early, so for the rest of the weekend it's just you and me on the couch, buddy. Number 8. Julia Louis-Dreyfus, Seinfeld Julia was pregnant throughout season 3 of Seinfeld. Since Elaine wasn't expecting, the producers had to get creative. There were the usual larger coats and hiding behind objects, and in season 3's The Subway, Elaine is on her way to a wedding, wearing an oversized red coat and carrying her gift on her stomach. Move! 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 <laughs> Elaine also went to Europe for the first couple of episodes of season 4, returning after Julia's maternity leave. Number 7. Jane Leaves, Frasier while Niles and Daphne have their own baby in the series finale, Jane Leaves was pregnant throughout season 8. Instead of hiding the pregnancy in a conventional way, the show had an ingenious solution. Daphne starts overeating and even hides snacks around the apartment. Strangely enough, everyone but Niles seems to notice. That is, until she falls and can't get up. After some heavy lifting by Niles, Frazier, and Martin Crane, she's back up again. As her overeating goes from bad to worse, Niles suggests she go to a weight loss retreat, which explains her absence for a few episodes. Number 6. Lauren Lane, The Nanny This actress, who played Maxwell Sheffield's business partner Cece Babcock, was expecting throughout season 5 of The Nanny. Cece drops some very obvious hints that Lauren Lane is having a baby. She first jokes about another pregnant sitcom star and carries the usual large props. In an especially funny scene, Cece later enters with a giant sign that says baby. There's no subtlety whatsoever, but that's what makes it work. And Elaine must have been, yeah, I don't know, 12 months pregnant. Number 5. Tyler Lee, Grey's Anatomy Being a doctor is not an easy job, especially at Seattle Grace. Ever wonder why Lexi stuffed her face in season 5? In real life, Kyler Lee was pregnant, so while Grey's Anatomy used the usual filming techniques to hide her baby bump, they also made Lexi stress eat. Lexi chows down at home, but especially at work. She's also got quite the sweet tooth, craving Reese's Cups, Twinkies, and chocolate. Number 4. Jane Krakowski, 30 Rock To quote 30 Rock executive producer Robert Carlock, quote, No child should have Jenna Maroney for a mother. So, when Jane Krakowski became pregnant with her son, the show went to great lengths to hide her bump. They started out with conventional tricks like having Jenna hold bags and filming her sitting down, but as her pregnancy continued, they came up with more unique ideas. The notoriously non-maternal Jenna suddenly really wants a baby, and even has a hysterical pregnancy. How are we not doing that, Sean? I'm a little baffled over here. Number 3. Melissa Fumero, Brooklyn Nine-Nine Unlike some other shows on this list, Brooklyn Nine-Nine didn't always hide Melissa Fumero's pregnancy. Early on, they chose the usual oversized bags, coats, and even a gift basket. But as season 3 progressed, the show decided to make the most out of her growing bump. In the episode Maximum Security, Amy goes undercover as a pregnant prisoner after Rose's fake bump backfires. While Amy's real identity is under wraps, her pregnancy sure isn't. I don't know. Is anyone gonna buy it? I mean, do I look pregnant? Number 2. Allison Hannigan, How I Met Your Mother this actress's second pregnancy was written into season 7 of this beloved sitcom. However, the show decided to hide Allison's first pregnancy in season 4. That is, until we learn about the gang's resumes. While the friends discuss entries that don't have anything to do with their current jobs, Lily's resume shows her to be quite the competitive eater. 
Back in 1995, Lily won a hot dog eating contest after downing 29 dogs in only eight minutes. As she is proclaimed the winner, Lily the Belly Aldrin lives up to her nickname, revealing Allison's real-life baby bump. Lily the Belly Aldrin! Number 1. Zoe Deschanel, New Girl For much of New Girl's fifth season, this adorable actress and singer was pregnant. The show used conventional and not-so-conventional ways to hide her growing bump. In the season premiere, Zoe was not far along, so they stuck to the usual baggier clothes and hiding behind objects. And of course, no premiere is complete without Jess falling downstairs and using a motorized scooter. By episode 3, Zoe was further along, so Jess began serving on jury duty, which gave her plenty of screen time sitting down. Meanwhile, Megan Fox's Reagan served as a replacement roommate until Jess's return. Hi! Oh my god, I am so sorry. Nobody was here when I got home and the bed just looked so good, I went full Goldilocks.